You know what they say about girls with short hair. I don't know what they say. What do they say? Do you know what they say? <laughs> Sit down, relax, relax, relax. You know what I'm saying. What? Hi, What's welcome up? back to my channel. It's Ogura Kabutha in the building. And since I'm mad awkward about introductions, we're just gonna start this video because me, I don't know what I'm supposed to say. You know my name, and now you've seen the title of the video. See, so we just start. Ah, let's start. Okay. The nigga, the nigga who's trying to get you drunk. Okay, it could also be white, Asian, whatever that is. But for the purposes of excitement and oomph, I got to say nigga. Now this guy will be buying drinks, as in every 20 minutes. You don't even need to ask them. They just like everyone having a good time. But, but... Unfortunately, this world is good and evil. There's a good guys who just want you to have a good time, like for band's sake. They're just like, yeah, let's turn up, let's have fun, girl, you know, come, let's have a good time. And then there's the nasty mother who are waiting for you to start slurring your words so that they can start shika shika you. Yeah? If you're the latter, shame on you. But if you're the cool one who just likes people having fun, yeah? on behalf of the community we would like to say thank you because we sincerely appreciate the work that you do that's what from a financial point of view what's even better for me is that i brought cash that now i don't have to use thanks that's those guys who are like wow you're so beautiful you're so gorgeous you're so pretty whatever all that bull crap like you think i've never owned a mirror is that what you think that i've never seen myself before like for the first time now at 22 is the one you're the one who said me that i'm beautiful don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong. Like, I like, like a good compliment here and there. But there's some who's just the only thing that they're saying. Hi, think, think, my dear friend. Think, yes. Like, I'm not saying this so that people will stop complimenting girls. But I'm just saying, in moderation, like, let even those words when they are coming to you, it's like, hey, then I must be beautiful today. You know, not, I, am I, hey? It tells me I'm not beautiful. You know, sometimes I'm just like, wow, I must, I, I must be gorgeous. I really, I'm sleeping on myself. I'm seriously sleeping on myself. Mm -hmm. For sure. Eh. You know, when you're dancing. <laughs> ladies, men, even ladies and gentlemen, all of them, because I don't know where, no one is safe. No one is safe. You know when you're dancing with your girl, minding your own business, how long nowhere you feel a kamodo just shikaying you behind? Or you're feeling like extra flesh and it's like... Hi. Hi. And some, oh my god, you know some can be mad aggressive. Let me tell you this, okay, a short story time. Let me tell you this funny story, but one time I went out with my friend... Green, we're gonna call her green because there are many plants here that are green. But what we went, I went out with my friend called Green. You know those nights for those ones. So on this night, I remember we, were we went to Carnival and there was an event. So as we were dancing, this guy kept coming behind me. He was first of all, he was short, as in there's nothing wrong with being short, but he was shorter than me. I was like, Oh, he's busy helping my knee. Like, what's going on? <sighs> So every time that he kept coming behind me, I'd tell him to stop, like clean. So the first time when I'm dancing, now I'm minding my own business, I told him, like I turned and I'm like, eh, stop. Politely. Like this is what pissed me off. Because I said politely, I didn't say like rude, like you are a nasty piece of thing. I just said, as in, I'm not the one. We continue dancing again. And the same guy, I'm feeling something humping my, the back of my knee. I'm wondering where it is, come it's him again. So I'm like, I okay. Yeah, it's me. You're confused. It's me. It's the same chick who just told you no. Sour. The third time, huh? I just looked at him like he was poo poo. Wait, I dance again and someone just did ah, like this. He smacked my ass and did this. Like, do you know? Do you know how disrespectful it is? First of all, it's disrespectful to smack someone's bum or touch me and then do this as in, hey! Ha! I just remember, I just turned like... But then I missed him. He did this. Shame on you. No, that's shame on you. Who raised you? Shameless. Ah, 
who are these people who can who who brings who comes with these people who brings them you know those guys that you go out with and they sleep for majority of the night like i'm talking they sleep from one to four and then at four o'clock they are waking up like you guys 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 you let me tell you why I like these guys because they make the best drivers in the morning. Because they slept the whole night. Continue. Msiache. 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 Wait. Now, unfortunately, I have male figures in my life who have these characteristics. Like, we'll be walking in the club. Everyone's looking for tables, but these motherfuckers are looking for their prey. You know? Their next target. How you doing? Oh, let me come don't don't run don't be scared don't be scared and each time we bump into each other like they have a different bitch in their arms i'm talking short tall all of them and god forbid i tell you god forbid that bitch sees you as a threat that time it's your brother or your cousin i'm just <laughs> i don't want him no mm -mm. that's incest that's nasty first of all I wish I could even tell you you are girl number four, so you're not even that special. Unfortunately, I'm not going to disrespect whatever little how I see in my cousin's arms because even me one day I will be in some other cousin's arms and I'll be that same little hoe. So it's a sake of life. But please note something else about predators. They go for anything. Anything that's breathing, they will go. You inhale, he'll be there. But that's not a me kind of problem. So worries. Do you? Do you? Do you? let's call this guy john doe so you know how you go out and you many of you so you may not know everyone in the table let's say you know like three people or four people but at least someone knows someone else so the next morning all of you are reminiscing about the night and it's like hey nah but who was that guy in the red shirt that was hogging the shisha and it's like ah that was patu's friend and patu is like z me i met him jana and Lisa comes to like, yo, I thought Steve and your friend were who, right? So you guys going to Chapa Shots? I'm like, nah, we went because they had gone with Jerry. Me, I even thought in Jerry's classmates. So I was like, oh, you guys must be classmates. You start thinking about how comfortable you are with this nigga with the bread shirt. But who is he? Who are you? Well played. Well played. You played us all. You played us all. You did. That was you. That was me. That's all that I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you can relate to these two characters that I've talked about. If you want a more intimate relationship with me, you can follow me on my social medias. If you don't want, dance online. Feel free to subscribe as well. And I'll see you guys next week. Sign out. Bye.